Today, I want to share with you uh, a tip that it's uh, that it's uh, alternative items. So we're going to pretend that we're that we want to create an an order. We receive an order from one of our customers. Uh, the customer is Parameter Technology, and uh, he's ordering some printers. Okay, so we, this is, uh, this is a printer. Let's, let's fix the form settings so that we can see, we have, we can see the item description. And also we wanna see the stock, in stock. Not this, not this, just in stock. Okay, so now we're gonna we're gonna fit the column width. Okay, so we see that we don't have stock for this particular um, printer, and we would like to know if there is another item that we can suggest to this customer or that we can maybe send to this customer. And for that, SAP Business One has the alternative items. So uh, this this item has not been yet set for to have an alternative item option. And what I'm going to show you is how you can do that. So you need to go to the item master data, which in this case, we're going to do just clicking on the golden arrow, but you can also do coming here in under inventory, under inventory and opening the item master data and looking for the specific uh, item. Uh, here you need to, in any place in the in the in this doc, in this uh, screen, you just click right click on your mouse, and you're going to look for alternative items. This is going to show you this window here, which is where you set alternative items for this item right here. So you're going to. I know that I have a very similar printer, which is from the same series. And it's uh, the code number, it's A00006. Uh, the only thing that I want to take into account whenever I recommend this printer uh, or I send this printer to a customer who was ordering uh, number seven is that this one, it's only available in black, for instance. Let's say that we had different designs and we know that this particular model is only available in black. But other than that, the match factor, and this is something, the information that we put on this column here, it's 100%. Uh, we could have other alternative items. You, can, you could input as many alternative items as you wish, and you can manually input the match factor for this item. So you could have other printers that, you know, match in features and in, in other characteristics, and it's only a 90% match or an 80% or even 70%, whatever you wish. And you could have a list of, of different um, alternative items that you can suggest or send to your customer when they order this one item and this one is not available or, or it's not in stock. So the only we're only gonna add this one and we're going to we click on add and what we can do once we've added this alternative item is if we if we click here on the on the number and this is going to highlight the row let me let me do this i don't know why it's not working okay when you click on the on the on the number and you get this line to be highlighted which for some reason is not working right now you will be able to click here to create a reverse link so that this item this item also becomes an alternative item for this one okay see that's that's the problem we were having it, it was a connection issue let me see if okay now we are able i'm able to show you that i apologize internet has been a little unstable these days i don't know if some of you are experiencing the same issues so once you click here on the number on the on the number row it will highlight the the full the full row for you and then you can click on reverse link and then we just update that and we click okay so if we go back to the sales order 
and we see now that this item is not in stock, we can then click here, you, you put you hover over the item number and you right click on your mouse and then you open alternative items. And this is what you will get. You will get a suggestion for an alternative item that you can use. It's showing you the stock information and the match factor. Okay, so you can choose this item and then it'll automatically substitute I'm sorry I didn't I didn't select it let me do that again so we go to alternative items then we choose it and that already updated our sales order I hope this tip was useful for you and uh, as always remember that uh, if you have any questions you can reach out to us let me bring up the screen with our phone number and our email and we're here and we're happy to help and uh, if you have any suggestions or any any tips that you want to share with other users please send an email and uh, i'll be happy to share that with with other users as well i hope you have a wonderful wonderful weekend see you tuesday <laughs>